this week's CAA Football Recap. As the number 15 Villanova Wildcats get set to take on the number one Blue Hens of Delaware. Babaro is back deep to take it. And he feels it is 15. Big hole up the middle. Look out. One man to beat down that left side. He could go. Touchdown. 85 yards with the opening kickoff of the game. Villanova said they had to throw a haymaker early. Well, you can't come out and hit the opposition in the mouth any harder. Third down and 10. And look at that. Kirkland comes in for the sack. And a high-flying start in the opening five minutes of this game. Here comes Caesar. And here he comes with the football and a block. And Matt Caesar, first down yardage and more. Down the left sideline. And he is shoved out of bounds at the 32-yard line. And Whitney firing out to White, hoping to beat his men to the outside, and he does, picks up a block. And he's going to have first down yardage inside the 20 on second and goal. The pitch to Whitney, he's got a wide open man. It's there for the touchdown. Lawrence Doss comes wide open, a little razzle-dazzle, and it's a 13 to nothing game. Fourth down, about 18 inches to go. And Whitney, piling ahead, didn't get it. Delaware stands up defensively and turns him away. No gain on the play. Devlin throwing complete. Crosby into Villanova territory. Delaware gets there for the first time today. Devlin has time. Throwing down the middle. Touchdown. Timing patterned and caught by Nigel White, the sophomore from Wayne. On play action, Devlin deep down the field, look out, it is caught by White. He went up the ladder and took it away from Martel Moody. Well, it looks like a three-man rush for Villanova. Throw across the middle, complete first down yardage. And down to the 12-yard line is Rob Jones. 1.22 to go till halftime. Throwing up on top, looking for it, got it, touchdown. Rob Jones with another catch. And after a nightmare of the beginning, Delaware's within an extra point of tie in the game. Reynolds is the man in motion. Now Bavaro and hit as he goes out of bounds, but another first down. 15th play of the drive. Whitney looking to throw. Now he can run. Running ahead. Touchdown! Chris Whitney finds the end zone. And Villanova takes the lead with 11.35 left to go. With 3.53 left to go. Wildcats blitz. Picked up again. Devlin. Devlin. Too much time. Shed Shout out. First down. And they got it to the 35 anyway. Delaware's got to get it in the end zone. Throw complete to Crosby. Another first down. Inside the 20 and the 15. A pickup of 20 yards on the play. Fourth and goal from just inside the two. For all the marbles. Under 30 seconds left to go. They've got to get into the end zone. Devlin. Throwing. Complete. Touchdown. Pierce broke the tackle of Loper and got in. They are going to kneel on the football. Let the clock wind down. And we are going to an overtime period here at Delaware Stadium. Just outside the one-yard line. Third down and goal. Ball leaping. Touchdown! Holy mackerel. Did he get up in the air? Pierce. Knocked down. Lost the football. It's out on the floor. The ball down on the ground. Did it come out? Villanova says they've got it. The officials are still trying to weave through the pack. Villanova says they've got the football. We're waiting. If they've got it, the game's over. It's over. A fumble of the football, and Villanova recovers. They win it in overtime, 28-21. Live from Zabel Stadium in Williamsburg, Virginia, on the campus of the College of William & Mary, it's CAA football. Today, the Richmond Spiders take on the William & Mary Tribe. Ball at the 29-yard line. 
Off the play action. Lop flicks it down the middle, complete the tight end. On the reception, Kevin Finney. And it's another first down for Richmond. Lop's going to carry it himself. He's got the first down. He's got more. And he is dragged down. A touchdown saving tackle. Will came in a sophomore to try a 22 yard field goal. He's 9 for 10 on the year. Now he's 10 for 11. Kamen drills a field goal, and Richmond scores first. Callahan on the roll to the right. Throws on the run, complete. The tight end, Alex Gottley, breaks the tackle and almost skies over another tackler. How about Alex Gottley, the junior tight end? Callahan barking signals. Mariner into the end zone. Touchdown, William and Mary. They're at their own 18-yard line. They lead in the game 7-3. to three. They're going to throw. It's a short pass. It's complete to Quires. He's got room on the left sideline. Across the 30, a burst of speed. Midfield, it's a foot race. At the 30, at the 20, he's bumped out of bounds. And a huge gain on a short pass from Mike Callahan to Jonathan Grimes. Play against that defense even more so. They executed it better. They picked up a big game. 64-yard gain. And now Cortland Mariner for an opening. Touchdown, William and Mary. Yards after contact. Got it. Got it. Callahan going to throw it deep for Ryan Moody. He's got it. Moody inside the 35. He pushed out of bounds almost at the 30. They lead by 11. Callahan under pressure. Throws complete. Chase Hill in the open. Across the 10 to the 5. Touchdown. Senior wide receiver Chase Hill. On a crossing pattern, was left in the open, and William and Mary opens up a bigger lead. Of the first half, or second half, that's why Coach Laycock was screaming at his quarterback. Third and 12, which been putting pressure on defensively. Callahan dances away, complete. Ryan Wolfe, first down across the 40, spinning at the 45 and up to the 49. So it's a 28-yard field goal attempt with 8.30 left in the third quarter. Here's the kick. And it is through there. Pressure coming from the outside. Lob steps up. Tipped. Intercepted. Picked off. Evan Franks, the linebacker. Bringing it back. And William & Mary's got possession. So Wimes, Cortland Mariner, and now Terrence Riggins share time at running back. Callahan finds a wide open. Tight end Alex Gottlieb for a touchdown. Third and six. William and Mary looking to put it in the air. Callahan throwing it deep for Moody. And Moody calls it in. Ho <laughs> ho! In between two defenders. Just the tribes just are making plays after plays after plays. There's an opening for Jonathan for uh, uh, Cortland Mariner or uh, Terrence Ricketts. It's Terrence Riggins. They use three different guys at running back. Hobson and Riggins set up in the eye. This is Terrence Riggins. Hit at the line, pushes forward, touchdown. Third down, second down at about uh, three. And some running room here for Beltoya Jones. Hauled down from behind, but not before he wrecks up yardage to the 15. He'll try a field goal here on fourth down. for Kuhn boots this one up and through. The final score, the Tribe of William & Mary, 41. The Spiders of Richmond 3. Follow all the action of CAA football online at caasports.com.